Friday, January 6, 2023. All the street cats were fed, accounted for, again, fresh food, friskies, canned food, and four cans of tuna and water. They love the tuna just like they love the sardines, and I always make sure my favorites of the street cats get at least a taste. Stubby made an appearance today. I hadn't seen Stubby in almost a week. Bully has stopped greeting me in the parking lot. He comes a few minutes late each day. He seems healthy. I always see him running the wrong way down the middle of the one-way street. Bully is too skinny. You can see on the camera how all the cats are pretty skinny. Little Tufa has become a regular for pets each day after three years of not petting her but feeding her every day. The same is true with Ginger. I pet her almost every day. Neither of them would let me pet them until recently, and even then, Ginger will only let me pet her during the daytime. I've noticed there are little black spots around little Ginger's eyes. I don't know if they're fleas or ticks, but a few of the street cats have minor ailments. I use every penny I have on these little street cats, but I just don't have that many pennies. There were a few criminal types on the streets today while feeding at 4 a.m., but they were respectful to me and didn't cause me any problems. I always look to the cats for verification. Somebody comes creeping up while we're feeding. I look at them, and they're like, if the cats are scared, then I should keep my guard up. But today, I was like, who are these guys? Are they cool? And the cats are like, yeah, they're cool. They're homeless, I guess. Most of the chickens and roosters stayed asleep today, perched on the fence. They normally do that this time of the year. There are a few bolder chickens and roosters that come down. Chase is the resident cat that scares off the chickens. He's like the security guard cat. Chatty Cathy is starting to meet me in the parking lot again, especially if there's tuna. Chatty Cathy loves tuna. Some cats can't get enough of tuna. When I first met Lucky, my inside black cat, three years ago, I opened a can of tuna and Lucky came running from two streets over to the busy street. She jumped a fence and came right up next to me while I'm opening the can with a can opener so both my hands are full. And then Lucky just comes up to me closely and just smacks me on the side of the cheek with her paw and claws. No power puff, just on the side of the cheek. And I'm like, what the F? What the heck are you doing? And to this day, if I open a can of tuna, Lucky just goes crazy. She just loves tuna. She'll claw, paw at my face, but she'll also make biscuits and start purring really loudly. Lucky's an oddball, but I love her. Black cats are something else. If you like this model, come back tomorrow. There's a new one every day. Aloha. Aloha.